Now I've come to Marble Arch, that's what's behind me, right in the middle of London, to have a look at a brand new car from a very, very old established company. And it doesn't have a petrol engine, which is what they've been making for over 100 years. It's an electric car. This is the Ford Mustang Mach-E. Welcome to Fully Charged. <laughs> So I think the, the biggest surprise that I've had seeing this now in the flesh is how it looks so much better than I expected. So I've seen pictures of it and there's something about the, it's the shape, it's the way it's, the curves on it are stunning. I mean, that, in yeah, real I, life, I, it's really different. Real life, real, real light gives it that absolute sculptural feel. And if you look at the, you can really appreciate the height here and the depth there yeah. uh, going back up. It's got this real sex, you know, yes. it's, it's this, yeah. It, it just gives you that, that, uh, that interconnecting uh, shapes that are really giving you that, that, that feel. Our goal is really to make the car look one size smaller. Yes. Just yes. to make sure it fits in this European in the, yes. context yeah. and, yeah. You, you know, it kind of like uh, uh, d doesn't, doesn't look uh, too, too enormous. Yeah. Too e enormous. But uh, the basic pro proportion, because we call it a Mustang, we try to make the roof lower. Right, we try to, right. Yeah. We try to make it as elegant as we yeah. could and you know yeah. that that really helped yeah. uh, setting the teams up right and then in here can we is this I think this is open isn't it yeah 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 that is great to have that storage space I see it's got a drainage hole is that a drainage hole yeah so if you, you can you can put in, ice, doesn't matter. ice right. in oh, you your ice. beers and you we can you can do you can do right. a big party here yeah. with a couple of different <laughs> Mackies <laughs> This is Ford's first uh, ground up uh, full battery electric vehicle. So this is a global uh, Ford battery electric uh, platform, all new uh, technology. Of course, not only the, uh, the drivetrain of this and the full electrification, we've really, really invested here in the, in the connectivity of this vehicle. Right. Smart vehicles for a smart world, we talk about. So the HMI interface, SYNC 4, this has a 15 inch uh, center yeah. screen that will actually learn about you as a, a as its owner. So right. as you as you use the vehicle, it will learn about where you go, how you drive. It will make uh, suggestions to you, and it will upgrade over time. We will also have over-the-air updates right. for this vehicle, so we'll be able to download improvements to the vehicle, yeah. and you'll be able to enhance your vehicle as you go. So the drivetrain is is obviously super important, but also the the connectivity of the car is. Um, has been a key focus for us. I know what our viewers will be really keen to find out. Let's do the first one. When, it, when will it be available in the UK and, and Europe? So available later this year. Right. Uh, we're taking orders uh, right now. So then can you give us the basic stats of the, like the battery size, the range, the... This is going to come in... Um, it does it come in more than one version? Yes, it does. So two battery sizes, uh, 75 kilowatt hours and 99 kilowatt hours, so the right. smaller and the larger battery. Uh, with the larger battery, we have a range of 370 miles. So right. what we're so pleased with is we will absolutely you know, make range anxiety a thing of the yeah. past. Uh, it's a rear wheel drive vehicle, but we'll also come in uh, all wheel drive. So rear right, wheel so drive. Standard, it's rear wheel drive. Standard rear wheel drive. Also comes in all wheel drive, fully independent uh, power to the front and the rear, because of course it doesn't have uh, your gears and shafts yeah. uh, driving that, the individual uh, motors. And then uh, we'll have a first edition. We've, we've actually sold out wow. of the first edition already. We announced that uh, yesterday. So uh, starting at a little over 40,000 pounds. Next year, uh, we will have a GT uh, right. version, which we haven't yet uh, 
as shown by that will be a super exciting vehicle. As far as this vehicle is concerned with charging, we're really trying to help customers. So with our Ford Pass app, which is uh, free uh, of charge to all consumers, you will be able to access through new motion well over 100,000 uh, charging points across uh, Europe. We've also formed a joint venture with some other industry partners in a company called Ionity, uh, which is providing high-speed uh, charging uh, you know, across Europe uh, on the major arterial routes. And you will get a free subscription to Ionity uh, for a year uh, when you buy a Mustang mach -E and favorable uh, pricing as well in those Ionity stations. The third thing we're doing is helping consumers to install uh, home charging. You know, what we have learned is that you know most customers actually charge their electric vehicle at home overnight. Yeah, by far the most, yeah. Particularly, of course, I mean, you need off-road parking yeah. uh, to do that. So through our dealers, uh, we're offering a, a, a Ford wall box, a smart wall box. You'll be able to you know, track the status of your vehicle right. um, on your phone and then also helping people to get that installed at their home because that's also sometimes a question, what sort of connection yeah. do I need? And then, so the range, the range on the, the top of the range one, so it was at 99 kilowatt hours is the, the, yes. the big one. Is it, yeah, that 370 is, miles. Yeah. Um, and there's that WLTP, has yes, that been right? That's right, right. Yeah. Which is, you know, close. I mean, what it means in day-to-day -day driving, like in the winter in the, U in the UK, is you'll get 340, 350 miles in on a rainy, miserable day yeah, yeah. with hills and wind. You know, those things yeah, do have I think it, a, it will a, be yeah, more, than, more than adequate uh, yeah. you know, to, to, oh, God, to spell. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, range anxiety. It's, yeah. it's going to be interesting. I think we're going to learn, you know, and maybe in the, initially a lot of people will go for the larger battery uh, yeah. because they, they believe you know, that they I think need first that range. time people who've That's never right. had an electric car before. And then yeah. when they've experienced it, they may well realize actually, yeah. you know, I, I don't need all of that and they'll yeah. go for the uh, the smaller battery, but that, that, that's one of the things we're going to learn as we go on this journey. Right. And then in terms of battery procurement, have you got a sort of, are you confident that you can build enough of them to yes. supply the, the demand? So obviously our, you know, our global purchasing team you know, uh, manages that. The battery for this vehicle uh, comes out of Poland, right. actually. And, um, but a you know, key challenge for us and the industry, of course, is projecting, because it takes a you know, battery supplier's time to lay down sure, yeah. capacity. And, and so projecting you know, a number of years out, what is the demand yeah. going to be? Because yeah. I, I think we all believe that your demand is going to increase yes. significantly. But to, to judge exactly, but exactly how. where. Yeah, yeah, and of yeah. course, if you're late or early, that's that's a, a business challenge. Yeah. But um, uh, but you know we we and we, the, the beauty of this is, of course, we're working on this uh, you know, globally. So as well, you can have some trade-offs between regions right. if if one market um, grows faster than another. No, it is a, it is a. I think it's a my personal opinion, but a very exciting time in a way for the ind for the automotive it is. industry. It is. It's, it's a completely. It's a new chapter, isn't it? Really, it is. is a big change. Yeah, it's, but I mean, this will be one of the most fundamental changes that we've yeah. undergone in, in many decades. And, and, and for us, this vehicle is, you know, it, it is is just that. This is our first full you know, battery electric vehicle yeah. ground up. It's a Mustang, which is you know a huge commitment on our part yes. to live up to the yes to that promise. That yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Three, two, one. Yeah. Good morning. Thank you. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Regent. Fabulous. Launch <laughs> complete. Please stay in your seat until you are unlocked. Welcome <laughs> to Ford's fully charged future. That's fabulous. We're very happy to be welcomed to Ford's fully charged future. <laughs> so that's been a really intriguing day. It's been a very short uh, experience driving in the Mackie. I didn't drive it, I just got a ride in it. it I can tell you, it's a, it's a really good car. Fascinating that Ford, one of the first mo big motor companies, first company to do mass production, are now mass producing an electric car. They were mass producing electric cars back in 1908. They had a bit of a gap when they did petrol ones, but they're doing it again. It's brilliant fun. If you get a chance to have a go in this bonkers thing, it's fantastic. 
kind of embarrassing for an old man like me to be having a go on a fairground ride, but it is really good. And it's quite an intriguing way of showing people what electric car acceleration is really like. So it's brilliant stuff. I'm so pleased forward to doing this. Really looking forward to doing a full review of the car later this year. Don't know quite when it's going to come out, but I think it's an impressive step forward. I really, really love the look of the car. It looks much better than it probably looks on a screen. Believe me, it is a really impressive looking machine. That's all. Please do subscribe to Fully Charged. As we always say, please do uh, have a look at the Patreon link that is beneath this video. And as always, as always, from Marble Arch in the middle of London, if you have been, thank you for watching.